Hello beautiful angels, it's Tessa of Akashic Soul Healing. Today our daily angels message is about uh, clearing and releasing any stuck energies around your root chakra. Actually tonight I just finished a session uh, teaching about chakras and uh, crystals that works at the root chakra. So I have this uh, feeling that I, I wanted to share this to you about uh, root chakra. So chakras are energy vortex. They're actually, you know, they're from ancient traditions in India all the way, you know, thousands of years ago. And it came from a Sanskrit word, which is chakra, meaning uh, wheel. So it's a vortex of energies. There's major seven chakras in our body, in our subtle body, which the prana, which is the force of uh, life, the breath of life, runs through the chakras. So the root chakra, I'd like to um, talk about the root chakra. This chakra is uh, located at the base of your spine and the color that vibrates in this uh, frequency is red. So when your chakra, when your root chakra is closed or, you know, um, polluted, like there's a lot of toxins or energies that are obscuring the, the channel, in your physical dimension, you'll probably experiencing, you know, um, fam in your family dynamics, you're probably experiencing separation, chaos. So it deals with your uh, survival, your family, your bloodline, your DNA, your ancient um, lineage. So th these are the contributing factors that you need to heal or clear. So then you, your root chakra could function to its uh, full uh, capacity. And how the crystals are related and are helping us, assisting us in um, harmonizing our energies like this hematite. This is hematite. It's good for grounding, protection, focus, and giving us clarity. And this is um, Snowflakes Obsidian, which is actually good for grounding, protection, and, and giving us, um, you know, uh, this beautiful crystal helps in clearing the space. So if you put it in your workspace, that would be really helpful to bring in um, inner peace. And garnet is a beautiful crystal. This is a raw garnet. It probably, if it's polished, it will be red. This is good for business, success, and just really feeling, you know, it opens your heart chakra as well. It's, it's, it connects to the blood, you know. when So the crystals that work with the root chakra are either... Um, red like ruby or black like hematite, uh, obsidian, onyx, tourmaline. So this is the, you know, the, uh, the crystals. So I guess I needed to give you a brief history about the crystals. So crystals are amazing uh, minerals. They're in our uh, mineral kingdom. And they were used thousands and millions of years ago by, by ancient Egypt. You know, like also it was mentioned in the Bible 200 times. Um, the high priest, the Hebrew priest wears a, a breastplate with 12 uh, amazing crystals. And in um, Egypt ancient civilization, lapis lazuli is really, 
powerful. It creates a bridge to connect to higher consciousness, which is like astral realm or um, different multi dimensions. So it's a multi dimensional crystal. And uh, like Saint Hildegard of Bingen actually uses crystals, they, uh, she pulverizes it and uses it for healing. So crystals are, are stable, they are very pristine, um, focus, stable, high, the highest frequency vibration objects in earth. So that's why they're very, they're incredible. So everything in the universe is energy, like you, me, the universe, the plants, the animals, we are all energy vibrating in different frequencies. Because the crystals are, are um, pristine and they, um, you know, they um, calibrate in high frequency. What happens is when we hold, this is a Shiva Lingam which is actually good for sacral chakra. And I guess it's also root chakra because of the, the perineum, the, the glands uh, testis. The, the glands that works for root chakra is adrenal for the fight or flight syndrome, like, um, you know, the survival instinct. And also... Uh, the the testes, the gonads. So when we hold this, because this has the energy of a higher frequency and healing properties, this is actually good for kundalini, for ascension, and for uh, sexuality, for cutting cords with other partners. So this... Shiva Lingam has these healing properties and when I hold it, when you hold the crystal, it interacts with my um, vibration. So things that are not, that are blocked or that I'm not uh, clearing, that I needed to clear, it synchronizes it. So when I create an intention for this crystal, it has to be clear and focused and that synchronizes with my consciousness. So that's how uh, the vibration of the crystals work. So in the root chakra, we're, we're clearing, um, you know, security. We need our security. We feel grounded. So we have this birthright to be here. That, um, that the universe, um, our, the universal energy is connected to us and we are a part of this universal energy. So we, we can increase our vibration, our frequency, so then we, we can acquire, you know, uh, more wisdom and purify our light so then we can radiate and assist others in their ascension process. So that's the knowledge that um, I want to share about the root chakra and the crystals that works with the root chakra. Well, thank you for listening and I will uh, just go daily and I'll meet you tomorrow and have a beautiful evening. Namaste.